Yeah, I think it was Echo Bass. So let's let's call this uh, Echo Cave. No, Tauntaun Cave. Oh, let's do this. App Ma Cave. So this is the App Ma Cave. Ape Ma Cave. Wapa. Ape Ma Wapa Cave. All right. So I need a torch. I need a redstone torch, and I need a pumpkin. All right, horse, we got one more trip to make tonight. One more trip. A redstone torch and a pumpkin. Think we can handle that? I think we can handle that. There's some more black dye that I don't need. Our ink quills I don't need at the moment. Keeping my eyes peeled for creepers. And also, every time I walk down this path, by the way, I'm looking around for things that will uh, catch the player's eye and distract the player. So even though I'm doing a lot of back and forth, I'm okay with it. Okay, Tauntaun is still alive. Good. Okay, so Redstone Torch... And a pumpkin. And here. I can't wait till I get to this scene. I don't remember if I've already spoiled it. I hope I didn't. But I've got a really good idea for that scene. It's a really good idea. A lot of these scenes so far have been Star Wars related. They're not all going to be Star Wars. Uh, in fact, well, Arrakis isn't really Star Wars, obviously. I mean, Sakara. Whoops. Spoiler. But this is a this is a heavily Star Wars influenced map, and I'm so much looking forward to Episode Seven. That is pretty much what these guys are filming <laughs> is Episode Seven, which is kind of a combination of all other episodes, I guess. Not really, but oh wait, the chest. Okay, I have enough to make a chest when I get there. Oh yeah, we've got the red stuff here. I don't really care about pigs. Okay, so I'm going to tie you up just for a moment. And I think I took the crafting table away from Sean, right? Yep. Actually, the zombies are hopefully spawning already, are they? I don't hear them. Whoops, there. I was actually hoping that when you when you walked up to her to get the book, oh, they are. Perfect. 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 Oh, shoot. I wanted to name this Okay, we need some more levels. We need to get up to seven levels. I'm at level three. I hope nothing comes out of the back of this cave. Are they getting caught on each other? Oh, I might need to make this a little bit wider. It's a nice place to fight them. Which may be too constrictive, actually. It may be too constrictive. Uh-oh. I hear you. Oh, oh no. Come on, XP. Come on. Just want to make sure nothing's sneaking up behind me. In fact, I'm going to do that. I would hate for a creeper to ruin what I've just spent so much time on. 
Oh, 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 three of you. Not quite enough XP. A little bit more. One more. I'll say I hear a zombie somewhere. I feel like I hear a zombie. Nope, I guess I don't. Am I hearing one down there? We don't want one. We don't want one spawning anywhere else but down here. Oh yeah, there they are. They just don't. There we go. Come on, guys. You guys have a 40 block aggro range, and you have a pretty, pretty tight pathing algorithm. So I'm not sure what your problem is. what your problem is. Oh, you're getting stuck on that block? Okay. Fine, we'll make it wider this way. And then we'll do this. Oh! I didn't want to do that. There. Let's get out of here. Oh, is it night? Oh, that's not good. Night isn't good. Night means something else could come up on me. Don't blow me up in my bed. Don't blow me up in my bed. Don't blow me up in my bed. Okay. Whew. Saved by the bell. Okay. So, redstone torch. And then let's go name the name the helmet. Over here. No creepers, no creepers, no creepers. I saw a cow. Okay. This is the Atma costume. Okay, excellent. So in this scene, you are playing the role of the Atmaw. And your job is to run in there, defeat, or uh, you've captured, you've captured the hero, and you're going to, you're going to run in there and you're going to uh, try to eat him, and he's going to cut your arm off. Actually, his zombie minions are going to cut your arm off, but, okay, so... Break a leg. Uh, oftentimes, you are asked to play the role of the terrible space monster. It's not always... It's not always the most um, glamorous of roles, but it pays the bills. Don the Apma costume. Put on the... So now, wait a minute, I'm talking to you as if I'm the... Ner if I'm the this is out of character book, I suppose. Put on the Atma costume. And so this book is not exactly written the same way the other book is. This is kind of out of character. That's okay. Put on the dreaded App Maw costume. Go into the back of the cave and film. Go into the back of the cave and then 
stomp menacingly into frame. And then stop menacingly into Be sure to growl. Be sure to growl. And when the hero drops down from the ceiling and cuts your arm off, let out a large howl. We'll take care of the rest in special effects. Okay, we're going to sign this bad boy. Uh, so this is actually, okay, scene one was the spawn. Scene two was the Sarlacc Commander Pit. Scene three is the green screen set we clean up. This is scene four? Yeah, this is scene four. Four. Okay, there we go. Got scene four is all done, completely done and ready to go in one sitting. I believe I have everything else that I need. I don't think there's any other special effects I need to do in that scene. Which means that it is time. It is time for me to move my horses to the back of this scene, which just needs the NPCs. I'm going to have to close that off with an iron door. You're going to basically come into camp, you're going to look around, and then you're going to go back out this way. And you're going to go up this way next. So, that means I want to put the horses back here. And I need enough fence for four horses. Let's put the horses like this. Four. Oh my gosh. I don't have a lead. Where's my lead? And I don't mean my lead actor. Also, at this point, if you still have any armor left, you could enchant it. Oh my god. Oof. The only thing I'm worried about is I only gave you one wooden sword, and by this point you are forced, potentially forced to fight some mobs. So it may actually be that you need some additional. Okay, we're gonna need a, we're gonna need some saddles over here. I wanted this to be right right there. Actually, no, I didn't. I don't want to block the license plate. There we go. We'll leave it just sticking out a bit. Okay, so let's head back. We basically need to fill this camp with some food and other stuff that could you could use in your Oh, she's... Wait. Why are you headed back to camp at all? I think someone in the first part said head back to base camp. I think someone said to do that back in the first part. That's right, isn't it? I don't need to explicitly tell you to go there because I've got the red sand trail. And the script supervisor will not be the person who gives you your next assignment. That will be... Hmm, I don't know who that'll be, actually. I'll have to think about that one offline a little bit. Alright, we got all these scenes. Yeah, so I guess the books are kind of a out-of-character slash in-character mix. I'm actually happy with them. Even though they're not exactly... I guess what I would say is, um, it's not 100% um, one or the other. 
Okay, now I'm going to need to take him over there on this leash. And then I'm going to close this up. So do I have dirt? I do have dirt. While I'm headed over there though, I might as well take a chest and some saddles. Uh, I don't have a chest. Miscellaneous. Let's take two saddles and We'll take the horse armor. I can't, I don't have enough levels to rename it right now. But what the heck, I might as well, right? I don't think I'll need to give you a saddle anywhere else. I don't think. I forgot what else I said I was going to bring over there. I'm not going to worry about it at the moment. Oh, let's put the let's put this moss stone. Well, the moss stone would look good in my mausoleum. Maybe if I ever die again, which probably won't happen because I'm so epic. <laughs> I am gonna need some other NPCs at the base camp. All right, but we're closing this off. We're saying goodbye to this entrance. Finally, I'll leave that one block there. Uh, I'm going to ride one of you. Where's the other lead? Two leads, good. Torch is gone. Okay, this is gone. Okay, horsey poo number one is up here. And horsey poo number two is here. So we're going to go this way. So I want to double check how far is it. Oh, now you're a slow one. So here's where I'm going to... Here's where I'm going to tie my black horse up, I think. How far is it to base camp if I come around this way? Oh, you're nice and slow, so I'm probably not going to lose lose the horse that I'm dragging behind. Okay, there's the back of this set. So I've come a little bit too... Oh, I lost him. There we go. Come on this way. We're going to go straight up and over here, so don't don't fall off. Good. We're going to go up here. Keep up. Good. Keeping up. Keeping up. There's a chicken. Alright, I may have to push you both across this water. So we're going to need a bridge somewhere. Oh, this is a wide water. Let's go over this way. Where it's a little bit narrower. Oh, I got an egg. Let's go here. Alright, are you going to come down or are you going to have an issue? Oh, you made it. You came across with me. Oh, no you didn't. Well, you did, but then you broke. Alright, come on, girl. Oh, excellent. So we don't even need to make a bridge. There's a natural land path here. Is this... Let's see, where's... Oh, perfect. Okay, so we're going to lead the players right up that way and around the back. Uh, and around the back. So this is a horse that players can get. Well, what I need to do then is make two golden apples. What I need to do is make two golden apples. There's a chest... Uh, what am I saying? Chest. There's a crafting table over here for a chest. Whoops. We'll go ahead and make a double chest.
It would be nice if you guys, like, stayed on the ground. Okay. We'll do that. We'll do this. If people want to come in here and put horse arm armor on horses, that is fine with me. There, that's sort of a pattern, right? We can do this. We can do... Oh gosh, that's a pig. That scared me. One, two, one, two. There. There. Oh, I have another one. So we can do that. Great. It doesn't look like anything. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, panic time, panic time, panic time. Horse, protect me. Horse, protect me. Dive under the covers. <laughs> A creeper could have just blown me to smithereens. Alright, horse, I might need you in case we're doing a quick getaway. Whew. Okay, let's block this off. Said I was going to do an iron door, didn't I? We'll just do this. So the players aren't tempted to go. Well, so they don't go in there. Um, okay, so I need to breed. I actually want to breed horses. Cause I want there to be one more horse without a saddle already on it. And the horse that I'm on right now is too slow. So we're going to put her here, and we're going to keep you, yeah, you're a bit faster. But we're going to get a pony. So I, this is the trail I need to bring the player. Oh, there's a spider. Oh, whoops, nope, I need to go across. Ah, I can put a bridge here. That's not too bad. Bring the player this way. And then I need to look for that pillar and, aim, and then take the player this way. And then I think somewhere, probably right around here might be where you find the next NPC. Okay, good. It's doubtful that the player is going to find this, but I will have to block this off at some point too. Oh, we are really cranking on this map now. We might be 40% done, maybe more. I'll, I'll have to check the calculations. Right now I'm going down here to get two golden apples. Because I think I need golden apples in order to get horses to do the limbato. I think I need golden apples. And I see some more NPCs have grown. That's good. There's one golden apple. There's two golden apples. Let's get a couple more NPCs here. There's one. Ah, excellent. Excellente, excellente. Okay, I think... Let me go back and breed those horses. Uh, it's going to make one pony, so I'm going to need one lead. <gasps> okay, so I'm going to need to make another lead. Good thing I checked that. So, you know. Uh, where did I put the slime balls? Miscellaneous? Yes, and string. Okay, and then there's this weird, weird crafting pattern. Two leads, one for the pony, one for me. That's that works. Uh, we've got melons. 
go in here. Actually, I'll just make 10 of these really quick. Oh, it's not 10. It's 3, 4. Okay. Four more eight little baby aliens, or whatever we're going to call them. Put this here. We'll put food up here. Put precious metals here. Got one extra saddle. I'll keep it for now. I do kind of... I do kind of, I only have two extra saddles. Okay. I do kind of want to make this multiplayer compatible for three players uh, in case the Dead Workers Party play this. But typically multiplayer is about two. Although... Okay, got my other leads. I should have three leads. Yep. Okay, so we want to go this way. I'm kind of ingraining this player path in my mind here. All right, I'm out. Looks good from here. Okay, I'm going this way this time. And then this way. And we're going to put a bridge over here somewhere. And this should come to the back of the camp. Is that right? Almost. I overshot it again. Just a little bit. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to trust you not to go anywhere. And you two. I don't really want another gray horse. Actually, so let's do this way. Oh no. I gave the golden apple to the wrong horse. So you can't, you can only breed horses that you own? Is that right? You're laughing at me. Shikes. Okay. Well, I just wasted two golden apples. Then I need to go make... Damn it! I wish I would have realized that. So you can only breed horses that you own. And I don't want to... I don't want to own that other horse because I want the player to be able to tame it and take it. Otherwise, this is going to be a long walk. And so actually, I'm only going to give them two horses. So if it is a three-player, someone's going to have to walk on foot. It's just the way it's going to be. Can't do nothing about that. Can't do nothing about that at the moment. Hmm. Well, you learn something new every day and every night as you play and as you fight. So I need two more golden apples. I mean, the good thing is I have unlimited time to go in and get get two more, like, the materials if I really need to. Oops. I don't plan to be using that much gold, so it shouldn't be that big a deal, though. Oh, and I see another, uh, another NPC has grown already. That's surprising. But awesome. I'm back here though. Huh. Okay, cool. Let's try this one more time. Oh, actually, you know what? Let's do this. Since we're out already. Box miscellaneous. We are going to go and try to get us some dogs. 94 bones, if I come across a dog, should be more than enough. Although, I do need to take some actual food with me. Well, we'll start with this. We'll do this. Alright, we're going to go tame, I mean, sorry, breed. Breed two horses. And then we're going to go looking for dogs. Now, Felonius said that there are some dogs to the south-southeast. I have not seen those dogs yet. Or at least I don't 
think I've seen those dogs. I found some dogs far to the north. I found some dogs far to the north. And I'm not actually too keen on going back there. Uh, oh, look at this. There's a bridge right here I could use. How is that in relation to the camp? Let's see. I think actually it's perfect. Oh yeah, right here. This is the path I want them to take out of the camp. It's the back way. Yep. Okay, let's try this again. We need to breed the two horses that are... There we go. Oh, and you made another gray. Well... I don't want all of the horses here to be gray, so I'm going to leave the black here. And I'm going to start taking the gray horse around. 